good with y'all. It's your boy Ross back here again with another video. So we're gonna check out Jeff Hardy's Swanton Bond compilation from 2000. Wow. This is a young Jeff Hardy right here, man. And the fact that he's still doing it in his 40s, man. He's still doing Swanton Bombs off the top of ladders at the age of, I'm gonna say he's like 43, correct me if I'm wrong, but he's still in his 40s doing that. That is ridiculous shout out to jeff hardy shout out to matt hardy man they've been entertaining us for so many years putting their bodies on the line for our entertainment so we're going to check out some of these retro clips man appreciate all the love and support road to 30k let's get into it classic bro oh my god bro just ridiculous just re oh my god dog. every time i see him hit the swanton bomb off like a high ladder or something like that it's just just like yo he just doesn't care about his spine oh man classic <laughs> oh my god oh my god and jr selling it don't do it jeff don't do it jeff Woo! <clears throat> Oh my goodness, yo. This is when the tag team division was so good, bro. And the funny thing is, there are a lot of talented wrestlers in the on the main roster that are or could be in the tag team division. It's just WWE doesn't know how to book them right. The tag team division should be even better than what it was before with the talented wrestlers they have it's just they don't book them right or they don't take time to showcase them which is mostly what it is they took time out of the weekly episodes to showcase the tag team division they don't really do that too much except the main tag teams we know about like uh the new day uh the usos uh who else is like the main ones um i can't even think of them because it they just be switching partners or they just don't push them long enough for you to even get a get a feel for a legitimate tag team. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh, yo. Where are you guys going? Oh. <laughs> Smackdown was so live, man. Look how rowdy the crowd was. <laughs> oh, man, yo. Oh, the old school SmackDown set. Oh my, yo, this is this is so great. This is bringing back so many memories, y'all. Oh my god, what ridiculous backlash! Oh my god, this is so great. <laughs> RP test. He <laughs> just got the ring bell. <laughs> this is so good, bro. He didn't get all of it. He got some of it. This is just putting a smile on my face. Just for the nostalgia fact, man. Oh my gosh. This is the wrestling I grew up on. Where SmackDown and Raw was so enjoyable to watch. Honestly, a lot of times SmackDown was the better show to watch back then, in my opinion. Because I didn't really have cable like that, except when I went to like my family's house. So they had cable. You know what I'm saying? So I could watch Monday Night Raw, but when I was at home, watching me some SmackDown. This is just bringing 
bringing back so much, so many great memories. Bro, just so, it just, the crowd just got so hyped anytime he went to the top rope or anywhere high. Look at this, bro. Just. Oh, man. Green. This is just great. This is great, man. This is just great. Jeff just did not care, bro. He was just. He didn't care how high it was. He was going to jump off of it into a swamp time bomb. Didn't care if it destroyed his back. He didn't care, man. That is what you call just the love of wrestling right there. I need to find me a Hardy Boys shirt because I definitely will rock some. Like some Hardy Boys shirts, I am definitely need to find me some old school retro Hardy Boy like wrestling teams, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> Who the fuck was these niggas? <laughs> And ladies love them some Jeff Hardy and Matt Hardy, bro. Like, for real. Oh, my. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Bro, this is just so great, yo. This is just, this is good, man. I'm so glad he was able to find like these old school clips. I'm so glad he was able to find these clips, bro. Just a simpler time, man, in wrestling. Just a simpler time in life back then, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, Lita was Lita was dope too. Don't get it twisted. Lita was. She could handle her own, man. Oh man, brought back so many good memories, man. I definitely need to find me a uh, um. A Hardy Boy shirt, man. I'm gonna try to find me one. If y'all know anywhere I can give me like some old school wrestling tees, let me know. I definitely want to buy some because it's just like, come on, man. Come on, who I, who wouldn't want to rock a Hardy's boy Hardy Boy shirt or a Stone Cold Steve Austin shirt or a Rock shirt? Like the retro Attitude Era shirts, man. They were super super dope, and I definitely wouldn't mind wearing some. But man, comment down below just your favorite moment from wrestling in the year 2000 i want to know what was your favorite moment from wrestling in the year 2000 let me know i would love to just go down memory lane and maybe if you can find some of those best moments send them to me and i'll check them out man i'm all for the the retro clips you know i love me some some attitude air wrestling for sure but i appreciate all the love and support on the channel road to 30k appreciate y'all kicking it with me see y'all on the next one peace